Ben says, hi guys, I've just finished creating my first tier two network. <laughs> I got plus one that, that's a lot. Um, I have a couple of questions. Where is the best place to learn about structured data and how to mark up a website? Ooh, I got the perfect one for you. Just give me one second. This are some of the best, uh, that's the schema generator. That's, I'll, I'll drop all these links guys. Let's, let me pull these up real quick. Cause Um, um, here we go. I'm trying to find the list of all. Here's one of them right here, and then I've got another one. There's two really good articles that I always refer to whenever I'm got something new to do because I don't know this shit off the top of my head, guys. I just um, I always have to refer to one of these guides to kind of guide me to whenever I'm I'm, I'm adding markup. Um, I'm not a coder. I don't even pretend to be one <laughs> on TV. So, but these are all these are both really really good. Is that the same article? Damn it! Let me find the other one. Just a minute. Uh, it's built visible. This is it. These are probably the two best guides that I know of for this. The built visible blog is fabulous. Um, this is one of them. There's another one too. Um, there's another one by built visible. If I can find it, let me try that real quick. Just give me one second. I'll have to find it, guys. I'm not looking. I'm, I've got to find it because it's it's in here somewhere. But I got so many damn articles in here. But I'll I'll drop these two links, and then when we're uh, when we're done, if I, Adam, if you can remind me, I'll uh, I'll come back and add the other ones. But these are some of the best resources for schema, and structured data, both JSON LD and microdata, depending on how you uh, need to implement. And then there's the microdata creator. Just go through some of these guides. Is all you need to do, really. Here's another one, and then here's a uh, JSON LD creator. This is this is pretty cool. Marco pointed this one out to me, and I use that now sometimes. I've, there's one other article. Um, I'll find it, and it's really really good. It's the best one of them, and for whatever reason, I'm not finding it right off the bat. But I'll get to it later. There's also just tons of of, but it's really geeky. The the information in in uh, schema.org. Yeah, it is. If you if you know how to um, if you know how to is this it? Geek with style? No, I'm sorry, guys. I'm I really want to find this for you, and I, I'm I'm just having trouble finding it right now. So um, I'll find it, and I'll post it on the page later. Anyway, um, yeah. Uh, if if you go onto schema.org, if you if you understand microdata and like the markup and what the tags are, the the um, what do they call them? The types item types and that kind of stuff, then you can get everything you need right from schema.org. But you have to know how to put them into the, you know, the proper div tags and all that kind of stuff. And that's what I always have to refer to resources for because I don't know, you know, I'm not a coder, so. Um, but yeah, Ben, I'll post the other link as soon as I can find it. Um, I'll have to wait till the webinar is over. Um, by the way, I found that article. I just needed to not be talking <laughs> to find it. This is it, guys. This is built visible. This one, microdata, JSON LD, and schema.org, rich snippets. This is the best guide I've ever seen on this. It is so comprehensive. Um, so this is what I this is my go-to guide for any anytime I have any um, you know, I have to add any sort of microdata to stuff. This is what I go to. This is hands down the best guide I've ever seen for that, and it's free. So enjoy it.